Okay, so one question I get a lot, you know, in chats with random people and everything all the time when I'm off camera, not recording or whatever. One question I get is, how do I feel about VTubers? Well, if you've read the title, you might know what I'm about to say, but I hate VTubers. I think a VTuber is fucking stupid. And I'm gonna give my reasons why I think v being a VTuber is stupid because there's honestly quite a few things to talk about <laughs> on the subject. Number one. What's the point? You're basically just making yourself do more work and designing a VTuber, animating them, and stuff like that. Hiding your voice if you use a voice changer or something like that. You're basically making yourself do more work. Just for something you could, you know, just do like I'm doing right now. Like, there's no, like, animated character on the screen except Claire, obviously, because, you know, gameplay and everything like that. But again, there's no an like anime cartoon character or whatever. I've got I don't have that because instead of being a VTuber, you could literally do just what I'm doing right now, just having the gameplay, commentating over it, something like that. That's all you really need to do. You don't have to go through all that extra work when you can literally just do what I do now and not have videos take longer to edit and whatever because when you do that it's you're basically like <clears throat> Like, I'm not going- I'm going to be honest. Videos like this and everything else I do is low effort. Don't get me wrong, it is low effort. But you know what? Even a little F- even something that takes low effort can go a long way. Like... I'm- I don't really stream anymore. Unless I absolutely feel- I'm absolutely in the mood to, but otherwise I don't stream. Which is what most, if not all, VTubers do, is stream and everything. So, yeah, I, plus, again, it takes a lot of extra time and everything is set up, which I'm not willing to, yeah, like I could do it, but there'd just be no point because I'd be if I did do VTuber stuff, I basically just be doing what I'm doing now, but just giving myself more work, which honestly is really fucking stupid. Because again, even a little effort can go a long way. People might be thinking, oh, I'm saying this because you're jealous of these people who got like over a thousand subscribers or a million or whatever because you've only got 47, so you're jealous of them. Like, no, I'm not jealous. Like, no. Like, I don't care if I have 47 because in some cases, having less is better than having more. Because, again, <laughs> if you have a small channel, you're not exactly 100% free from, like, allegations 
or whatever, but you're less prone to them. You're less prone to like allegations and stuff like that if you have a small channel. Granted, you're not 100% exempt, but you are less of a target. So I'm not like at quote unquote jealous at all or any about anything. Cause I honestly prefer being small. Like if I hit a thousand six plus subscribers, that'd be great. I would be very grateful. That like a thousand people or whatever are willing to take time out of the day that they could be do they could be spending like going to college, getting becoming a doctor, lawyer or something like that. I'd be very thankful that someone would be willing to risk not getting all that just to watch me for like however long. <laughs> really, I am because that means that people watch me for who I really am you know and that's you know someone who r likes that you know actually have fun playing games they play even though you know a lot of stuff is low effort but still if you have fun that's what matters low effort or not I don't need to hide behind an anime character or whatever to entertain people because I'm gonna I'm gonna be honest with you I love being like real I, I love being a r myself a real person I'm not ashamed to show my face on camera, which I'm about to do like right now. Hey, it's me, and yeah, I've got cherry vanilla coke with me. <laughs> what a surprise, right? But yeah, anyways, hi. <laughs> this is a segment where I, you know, formerly meant former formally formerly. It's easy to mix those two up. My mistake. I apologize for that, but it's easy. This is the part where I formerly addressed where I said I was going to show myself on camera because you know I'm again I'm not afraid to show who I actually am on camera. Here you are with my cherry vanilla coke. Shit, this is real. This is good. This is my favorite soda ever. It's really good. I recommend you trying it. One of the best things I've ever had in my. It's one of my favorite things ever. <laughs> yeah. Oh fuck! I forgot. It's like 1:30 almost. I have to check my progress on my stuff on eBay. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna do that. But yeah, little change in scenery because John's got this music music playing downstairs, and you know, copyright ID and stuff. To it. So I moved to the kitchen. This is my little like you know burner phone. Do my little burner phone that I have, like just in case. It says 2:44 on the top right corner, but it's actually 1:44. It was the only way I could get actually get things to like work properly on this phone. But yeah, yeah, I'm gonna tap eBay right there. I gotta keep my voice down, but also a to make it to where you can still hear me. But yeah, I got stuff on my, in my cart. My spellbinding circle is being shipped, which is good. Ordered that like a little over a week ago. <laughs> uh, yeah, this is 
all stuff that's come in. On the way. The tracking number provided awesome. Oh, I hear baby in the background. This is in transit. Awesome. This my palladium oracle mana and these two are in the same order, so they're going they they're being shipped by the same person, so they're gonna come at the exact same time. In the same envelope, I'm sure. My slifer. Origin processing. Oh, that's almost two days ago. Order details. It's finally being shipped. 16th. Nice. And this I ordered, you know, on the 6th, 10 days ago. And it's finally just now starting to get shipped and everything. <laughs> Origin processing, but yeah, that's progress on that. Don't please enjoy the rest of the rant. All right, so going back to yeah, going back to what I was saying. There's more reasons VTubers are stupid. One of them is you never know who could be. And the biggest way it's stupid is you never know who the who could be, you know, behind the screen. Like I wrote, I sh show myself off, like obviously, just not too long ago. And for those who know me off screen, you'll know how I am. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm pretty laid back, but again, you never know who could be behind the screen as the VTuber. It could be, you know, a registered sex offender. Could be a registered sex offender, could be a murderer. It can be anything, really. You just never know who might be behind the... It could be a fat, bald, middle-aged man. Seeking, you know, kids. It's it's disgusting. Like it's really disgusting. Cause you, <laughs> anybody could be behind. the camera and everything but I mean, and another thing is a lot of people like to say like these VTubers or what these live streamers even are like their girlfriend or just do what they can to you know get the streamers attention whatever in fact there was even one guy who still gave someone his entire fucking paycheck and everything got made himself basically homeless just because he liked her which you know is a problem on its own why do people do this I guess it's because they just they can't get a girl of their, on their own so they have to rely on like these people characters or whatever who are kind of just like there to just entertain for like a short time or a few hours or whatever and then once you know they're done they'll just pretend you don't exist afterwards it's 
it's wrong on both ends. Like, sure, the people when the attention of the streamer, person, what YouTuber, whatever, it's wrong that they would go to those those heights just to get even a second of potential or even a thank you. It's also in the the stream the streamer themselves is also wrong for you know pretend the person doesn't exist after the stream ends it's it's really disgusting on both ends like it's sad but it's also disgusting like i feel bad for the people for people like that but i also don't feel bad for them at the same time because they do it to themselves and whenever they get their heart broken when a streamer vtuber or whoever they like and want to you know fall in love with is actually dating someone or is married outside of you know the streams and stuff like that those people who watch that streamer or whatever go get mad harass and do all this stuff to the person just because you know they didn't show the truth and everything they didn't tell the truth they didn't show they didn't really you know care for them to begin with well guess and I have one thing to tell them. Guess what? That's that's life. That's reality. If you it, get this, it's adults doing it. Gr like grown adults doing this shit. And they wonder why they don't have like a significant other. It's because they do shit like that. That's why they don't have a significant other. That shows that they're a pathetic fucking loser. And it's just, it's just not right on either end. It's honestly sad. But yeah, that's my whole take on, you know, the VTuber thing and everything like that. It doesn't just go for VTubers, it goes for like the stream IRL streamers, people who stream daily. Cause people who, you know, do the shit with VTubers have to do that with real streamers. Like the streamers themselves, not just, you know. A character the streamer made, whatnot. It's people do that shit. It's really sad. Like I hate to see it, but at the same time, it's really funny to see that there are people like that who shit do shit like. That. <laughs> like it's depressing, but at the same time, they do it to themselves. So. It's kind of like a... You want to be stupid? Well... You're the one that's to blame for being stupid. It's your fault. Like, you may think that's... You may say that's mean. Or hurtful or whatnot. Again, that's life. Don't like it? That's what I can tell you. That's just how life is. I... There's nothing we can do about it. We live this way. That's how life is. Get over it. Yeah, that's all I really have to say on the situation. And how I think... What I think of VTubers and stuff like that. Let me know what you think about, you know, VTubers in the comments, and I'll see you in the next video.